there guys and welcome to my channel it is Karen here with you again today of course it's always me it's my channel so today I am working in my large dilutions journal and I'm going to start off with doing a collage and I've got some old music paper here out of an old learn to play the organ book that I picked up at an antique store for four bucks so I've ripped some of that up and I'm just gluing it down with some matte medium um, I've also got some dictionary paper here poor old dictionary it's lost part of its you know alphabet whatever it's all good and I've also got a bit of a children's book that I've ripped up as well so I've glued that in too now today I am using some printables from Tandy Art I'll put a link down in the description so you can go check them out but I've printed this one here out onto some well it's kind of a rice paper but it's I think it's cool it's more of a rayon like it's um it's a special paper that you can actually print on so you don't have to do any um you know you don't have to have a carrier page or anything like that you can just pop it in your printer and it will print and of course the colors come out so beautifully unfortunately it is a little bit thick but you know that's that's the takeoff but it was really nice to work with so I've got my large image here and I'm just ripping off the excess paper around the outside of that so that I can um, glue her into my book and I did have a little bit of trouble so really what I should have done was use a wet paintbrush to wet the paper and then I would have been able to um, tear it easier but anyway there she is isn't she cute oh, I think she's so cute anyway there she is I love her um, I've also got some other printables as well that I've cut out and you'll see them pop up in a little while so I'm just gluing some extra bits of the Tandy Art um, collage paper into my background so you can still see all the writing and whatnot but it's got that little pop of color as well so once I've got all that dry I'm actually putting a layer of clear gesso right over the top um, just to help seal in the old papers and the rice papers so then when I add in my next part you know it doesn't actually really soak in lots but before I do that I'm going to add in some black gesso lines and I make a royal mess of it right there look at that goodness me that's not what you want to do anyway I cleaned it up so I'm gonna do four lines here because I think that's all that I need for my quote so I'll get that nice and dry and I'm going to grab out my Lindy's Magicals. Um, I haven't used these for quite a while, so I thought, <laughs> why not? So I've got a little paint palette out and I'm just sprinkling a tiny bit of color into the wells and then adding some water on it to get it activated to turn it into a paint. And now I'm coming in with just a, you know, a paintbrush, <laughs> of course, to add, to spread my color around and make my background a little bit prettier so you can still see all the all the music paper and the book paper and the dictionary paper and everything else all in the background so I'm really happy with how it's looking so far but it's not quite bright enough here in a minute so I'll just use this bit here up try not to dip my pen my paintbrush into my coffee <laughs> Oh dear okay so I've just um, about to add a few more sprinkles there we go to brighten it up wowzers so you don't need very much and it's really intense these Lindy's so yeah they're cool so I'll just activate that little bit add a bit up the top and I'm gonna grab another color I can't remember what the colors are called I just grabbed them out of the out of the basket there we go that's looking a bit more me <laughs> I like it I really love that image she's so cute okay so that's one of my little collage pieces also from Tandy Art that I've cut out so the little butterflies and little hearts on this um, sheet again it's all in the description so you can check it out down there so I've cut them out and I'm just gluing them in with a little bit of art glitter glue 
gesso that looks pretty cool make sure that gesso is nice and dry okay so I've got out a white charcoal pencil just so I can kind of map out where my words are going to go on these black lines and the quotes the quote says until you spread your wings you'll have you have no idea how far you'll fly so I'm just mapping it out with that charcoal pencil and I'm going to realize here very shortly that oh oh I shouldn't have stuck those butterflies in goodness me so now I'm gonna have to paint another little black gesso line here a half one <laughs> so that I can put the very last word in dear me so note to self don't stick down bits on black gesso when you're writing quotes okay so you saw up the top that I didn't quite have enough room to put in my last letter so because it's charcoal I can actually wipe it off and do it again how cool is that so I'm pretty happy with how that is I'm just going to add some black doodles around those die cuts or some of them okay so I've zoomed in a little bit here now so you can kind of see a bit better what I'm writing and you can still see the charcoal through I mean underneath the, the the Posca pen as well so we'll fix that up in a minute so I'm just um you know writing my letters but I'm writing my letters in big and uppercase so um to mix it up a little bit it makes it look cool now the pencil that I've got there is actually a water soluble graphite pencils from Faber Castell so um yeah so it works kind of the same very much as a stabilo I don't know how water reactive it is again afterwards but yeah that was cool okay so I'm mopping up my bit of charcoal that you can still see in those and get that nice and dry and the very last thing that I'm actually going to do is grab out my archival no what is it liquitex liquid ink and i'm gonna do a few splats which you just saw there so i'm just mopping up so that's it so here's a couple of close-ups of my page i hope you have enjoyed it um yeah i love tandy art images so there you go i think she turned out cute Alrighty, please like and subscribe if you haven't done already and until next time i will see you later bye bye